many people have forsaken their family, their marriage, their devotion to God for ministry. Many people are devoted to ministry. Many people have forsaken their families, their husbands, their wives, their children. They have even forsaken God for ministry. I want to give you some encouragement. Last night I asked the boys, when you think of me, what do you think? Like, what do I represent to you when you think of me? And Shiloh said, you want to know God more and you want to spread his word. You want to spread the gospel, his gospel. And Elijah said, when I think of you, I think 100% Jesus and 100% family. I was stunned. He didn't say 50% Jesus, 50% family. He also did not say 50% ministry, 50% family. He said 100% Jesus. I love that neither one of them said, you love being at the church. You love ministry. Neither one of them said that. Both of them said, you want to know God more. You are 100% about Jesus. You want to spread his word and you're 100% family. You do not have to forsake. Listen, your love, oh, in the name of Jesus, your love for your family looking like hate compared to your love for Jesus will look like extravagant love to your family. I said, so neither one of you feel neglected by me? And they said, not even a little. Because you know why? I remember years ago, the Lord speaking to me, I really felt the Holy Spirit said, if you look after the things that concern me, I will look after the things that concern you. Oh, hasn't that proven true? Oh, he is beautiful. He is beautiful. He is beautiful. Everything you ever need. Everything you ever dream, everything I'll ever need is in Jesus. Oh, that's just coming back to me. Everything I'll ever need, everything I've ever dreamed, everything something is in Jesus. And then I don't remember the rest of that. I'm sure that some of y'all probably do. Y'all, I'm so excited about Jesus. I'm so excited about Jesus.